So hello guys, I'm back with a new deck tech video today. I want to show you a modern brew I've been working like the last couple of weeks playtesting it, finding flex spots. This is not the final list I want to show you today, I want to show you like the version I had like three or four days ago. Uh, because I'm going to bring this deck to the event next weekend with the new version. So I've changed a few cards, but yeah, this is I mean, it's still the same deck. I've my change a few flex cards and cyclops cards and stuff like that. So I call it Esposico of the Way <laughs> because of the beam. Yeah, all of you guys probably know. So it's an Espa like spell based deck. So I mean, it's not really spell based, but it has a lot of cantrips, hand disruption, and removal. Mm -hmm. So like the Grixis Shadow decks, mm -hmm. but it doesn't go like with Esper Shadow. Um, this deck plays. Seek of the way Tazuko and Lingami Souls to win the game. So I'm going with the cards quickly and then the runner base and then some sideboard cards. So I've lined up all the one mana spells here and then going to the two mana the two mana spots and then the three mana spots and so on. Yeah, so we've replaced it of Fatal Push. Um I've had a 3 3 split with Path to Exile or a 4 2 split with Path to Exile. But I'm on for a push right now. It's a concession to how aggressive humans is. It's less good against Toro One, but it's, I think it's better against Chandler Humans, which are the two current decks. And we really one plays Toro One here in Austria. The same goes for humans, but many people play Chant, so I like this card better against Chant than Path to Exile. Because this gives them a free land and the access to land into Blood Breath faster. Then we have like the split of three inquisitions, so I'm just going to put them all here. Oh no, this isn't that I don't know. So we have a split of three inquisition here, inquisition of course, the egg, hand disruption spell, and three shorts use. I tested as well four and two and two and four. But I think that three three is the way to go here. The way to go here. <laughs> And then for the cantrips, so as of the path tag, so there's another one mana removal. So we have six one mana removal and six one mana discard spells. And then we have eight one mana cantrips around a page of serum visions. It's just like the best blue cantrip in modern. I don't think I'm betting Pew then or something like that would. I mean, I'm betting Brainstorm would definitely ruin the format, but I'm betting cards like Pew then. I don't think it would be too bad. And then Fault Score, this is just it. It's a good synergy card with Lingering Source and Tazuku, and you can like mess up your opponents with their surprise and like see emotions or if they desperately need a land and scry top, they can just go and move themselves sometimes. Yeah, then the three forces we already talked about. Then we have two collective fatalities. This is like I made a concession against Chant and Humans. I mean, it's also good against like spare based decks or control decks, but I think this card is, I mean, it's not that good against Humans, but it's like kill a creature and gain 2 life and against chance it's like kill a creature, take a removal spell and sometimes drain for 2 yeah I think that card is good enough to be played in the main deck here um, I might cut it in my, I at least move it to the sideboard in the future list I'm working on but I haven't had enough time lately to really chest this card and whenever I draw it, it was ok at least then we have a place of Seeker of the Way, which is the namesake card of the deck. This is now I shifted down to a common and I think it was an Eternal Masters and the Eternal Masters Iconic Masters. So this is proper legal. So we're playing proper cards here in Mulan. It's a two mana two to with prowess and whenever you cast a non creature spell so a second prowess trigger, um he gains lifelink until the end of turn. So this works really well with all the cantrips and removal spells. You can easily swing in for 3, 4, 5, 6 damage with it. And this has good synergy with painful tools, which I'm going to discuss later. So you can't see this quite here. So yeah, I'm going to move it here. So you can read the card if you're not familiar with it. Then Tuliliana of the Way, I think she's like a mainstay card in modern right now in black decks. She's really good against Bogus. Yeah, then we have like a place of Lingering Souls. I think Lingering Souls is a very good magic card right now. I think it's almost as, as the best as, as it has ever been before. It's good against humans, good against Chant. I even think it's good against Hollow One decks. 
just creating a 4 1 1 fly up around mana seems like really strong. And then we have this painful truth. So, when painful truths came out, I was really excited to play the card in Moran. But losing 3 life to draw 3 cards and only in a 3 card deck seems like a big deal. But in this deck, it's really good. You play turn 2 Seeker, then turn, it's like turn 1 discard spell, take the removal, turn 2 Seeker, turn 3 painful proofs, and you plus 2 life because you gain 3 from the Seeker. I've drawn 3 cards. So the card is really good in this deck. Um, chase the Mind Sculptor. Uh, this one reflects a lot of cards, but in the way right now, I think I'm confident running 1 Chase in the main deck. But that might change as well. Um, then I'm a free test ago, so I also tried Gormak Angers, but I was a little bit underwhelmed with Gormak Angers because this deck has like more the late game reach than it. So it it doesn't really care about the one power, you have the spirits that chip in for one, you don't need the fifth power, and the Tazigo and the Melability has been relevant several times. So I bought the Mana Base, and now the Mana Base looks a little bit shanky, we have like one creep on top of it, this is a man land. I've won several games in the back of it, but I don't want to have a second tablet in the deck because if like these um, six discard spells turn one and this eight cantrips you want to fire off on turn one. So then we have one dark sexuals, it's just a fast land, so it's good in Moron. I mean, you want to reduce your damage take from my mana base, you run fast lands. Then we have a playset of the flood strand, so the blue white fetch land. Because the deck is base blue and splashes. It's basically blue and black and splashes white, but it's more like blue than black, I think, although it doesn't look like it. But this fetches, I think it's better than black white fetches. Because you more, want to more often fetch on basic islands. We have one of God Shrine, which is the black white fetch land, which is the least important one. So we have two hollowed fountains, the blue white fetch land, we have two basic islands. So we can cast all of our spells even on the blood moon if you fetch correctly. For March fetch, March flats, yeah. This is the ninth fetch in our deck. Uh, fetch is a good of Tessico, but they're like kind of paying for the middle. Some kind of aggressive right now, so I don't want to have like the 12 fetches or the 10 fetches. I think 9 is a fine spot. Then one planes, again, blood moon for polluted dead, also the blue black fetch. This is the best fetch land in our deck. Then two Seatrum Coasts, so I had one of them first and I had like the black white fast one as well. But I decided to go to Seatrum Coast because blue mana is more necessary than black mana, I think. Then we have one of Basic Swamp and two Water Recreate, which is the blue black fetch lanterns. That's the most important shock in the deck, so yeah. So that's about the deck, so it's like um, spell based, like. A mixture between control and mid range, I would say. It's like Death Shadow deck, but it doesn't play Death Shadow, it plays Seeker of the way. So now let's talk about sideboard cards. Um, I have one Engineer Explosive here. This is like a good catch all in a free mana deck. You can play it and remove almost every permanent you care about. Good against Borgers and Humans. And so I'm to check this card is good against Tron or like a Tron. You can even consider it against decks like Emulet Titan, although I don't like it against the deck. You can consider it against hollow ones to counter the hollow ones. And here is Bear Bomb. This is just good against any grave attacks. So I'm going to move that over here space so you can read the cards. Um, good against champ matchups because they have Kick on the Mother Pyramid. So then two dispels. This card is really necessary for a control matchup. The control matchup has been pretty good for me so far. I've beaten control, I think, three of the three times I faced it. Then we have uh, third path to exile against decks like Hollow One, against decks like Humans, against decks like Emulator Titan, because I think the deck is going to pick up a lot of popularity. Then we have a counter scroll again against control decks. I have one of Dampening Sphere, Damping Sphere, I always call it Dampening Sphere, but it's Damping Sphere. Um, I haven't really got to play with this card. I played a lot against it with Emulator Titan because everyone just decided to slam this card for us in the sideboard. And it's not that good against Emerald Titans, people think, I have to say. Um, it's like, it slows you down for one or two turns, but it's not a scheme over Blood Moon. You are, you can still activate your lands. Then we have Sledge to Purge, this is like, good against Black Red decks, so Chant, Hollow One, uh, Mother Pyramid, uh, Shadow decks. Then, two Stony Silence. This deck, 
looks a little bit weak against Affinity, although I think it's really good against Affinity because you have four lingering swords, but you only have six removal spells in the main deck. But uh, you add up Engineer Explosives, Path to Exile, Settle the Recatcher, Stony Silences against Affinity, so the Affinity matchup is definitely fine. Then one negate again, control decks, I think in Molan, spell based decks, I think in Molan, combo decks, I think in Molan, KCI, stuff like that. That's also a thing because KCI became a thing. Then one of the of the last hope, um, I played a main once and I'm probably going to play her main on Saturday, uh, so the next Saturday where I'll do tournament is, because she has been pretty good for me so far. Every time I brought her in, I know that's like. This card is good when you bring her in and you bring her you not bring her you don't bring her when she's bad so yeah but i was really impressed with her on the deck and then to the record just i had like nations and stuff like that because double white can be harsh sometimes to get there but um this card like no one expects out of this deck that you bring in settle the record just so i've been pretty impressed with it how like the potential of the card is so high that you want to run like the risk of not having double white although if you play post games with some of the wreckage you tend to be more white fetch since in the matchup you are bringing some of the wreckage you also bring in path to exile and depends on the colors also sledge the purge and or stony silence so yeah, that is about the deck tech so let's just hop into some games i want to try to get five games with this deck although i don't know how long i want to play and how long uh, I want to stay awake because it's already half past 10 p.m. here. Just hop into a brick modern game with as per Seeker of the Way. So, I know there are seats. Now I'm not done with the tennis table, so let's just create a new one. Oh, that boy is just fake. <laughs> okay, so. Alright. Oh, I forgot to twist. You have to. You want to see the game? I think. Let's just fix this here. Completely, completely forgot about that. I zoomed in. So yeah. Not box. Block from. So this hand is pretty good. If I turn on this card, turn to re remove rent and turn to ring any source. My opponent takes a mulligan. Range is handless is against Tron, but he takes a mulligan with five, but. I think this deck has a pretty bad Tron matchup, honestly. I haven't played. I don't think I've ever played against Tron with this deck. I'm gonna push around to the board to see. Probably thinking I play Lantern now. Humans. Okay, this is, seems like an old list of humans with Maya and not the I'm just gonna take the champion. Because I don't run Maya anymore in humans. So we have Kevin, Nova, Territory. Okay, best Kevin Novas with territory and Maya. Okay. So let's just go out and run the Foxes. Run Foxes in again. And it's just going to the seat. Okay. But against this seems like Kambar is interesting. So let's bring in engine explosives from the sideboard, path to exit from the sideboard. Um, sort of the record chess and the Liana of the way. I don't like Chase the Mind Scout in the matchup, I don't like Liliana of the Wade in the matchup, I don't like Painful Troops in the matchup. But I think then we have to keep me on the Lilies, we to either keep Lilies or, or Liliana of the Wade or Painful Troops, so I'm going to cut a Fort Scar, I'm going to cut a Fort Seas on the draw, and let's leave him to Liliana of the Waves. So I'm just so quick more than one of us. Yeah, this seems fine. If the engineer goes to zero and three. No, it's good. So let's just update this quickly. I don't think my I think my opponent probably knows how to board, like it brings in a sync collector probably. They could reflect the mages, which might be bad for him. Maybe brings in hmm, stuff like craft Digger's Cage. I mean, he doesn't really know what I'm playing. Maybe he thinks about lanterns. They might bring in Reclamation Sage as well. Hmm. 
I'm gonna play like a few months by myself so I know. My field of counts just darkest, the stockiest so but this doesn't look like a stockiest since you played Maya still and Kambal. I mean Kambal can be a flex slot since humans has to flex slots, but I don't think you found Maya. If you can tell my much is so much better. But I don't know. <laughs> Everything can happen on next match. Let's just double check if you're still in our game. Yep, so you side going. Okay. So yeah, um, but I still have the old layout and I hate it because I have like problems with the new layout because I, mean, I don't hate the, the, hate the old, old layout but I think the new layout looks much smoother but I have like problems with, it with my the size of my screen and the layout and I'm still working it and Nathan helped me with it so or at least he's trying to help me. I haven't watched his, I haven't read his tips yet but since I had like a pretty rough time lately okay he quits the match wow what a waste of time so i don't even count this as a match like okay Mm -hmm. So we're in the play again. Um, this hand is like really slow and you don't have black mana, so I'm going to mulligan it. I'm just going to call this like, and this is a keep though. Just round 3.5. Cut the thing to the bottom. This is humans in zero. Okay, yes, I want it. Um, yeah, like this. Okay, so let's leave on the black fetch so we can push something and then pass the turn. I'm going more to get the five and scratch the bottom. Okay, there were secrets, interesting. So I'm definitely pushing that. I want to fetch a basic swamp here probably. Okay, we push it. Okay, so we have seamless mission which is really nice, so it's got steam missions. I think I want to keep at least one push here, but not two. Our Tesla guys are for our door. If you count us, it, it's not that bad. So here is pretty obvious man, but I'm just going to try and channel test through here. Oh, it just works nice. So Tesla goes really good against the Star Alex. Hmm, he seems like all our few revelations. <laughs> nice. Seems interesting, so let's just play what I grab tapped. And take for four and pass the turn. Oh pot score. Neat. Okay, here's another Delva. But if I push ready, so yeah. So that's fatal pushing. And then the pot's going to serve. And actually, yeah, the way it's great. Painful close is not so afraid when we're playing some half, okay. So it's just going to attack here. We don't want to cast painful troops in this matchup. Let's try to play a linear. Then play some tapped. 
plus intensified paint for troops. I have of this casualty. I might want to keep just paint for troops. Wow, Chase is nice. <laughs> oh, this deck. Absolutely loving it. Second people visions, okay. I don't care, I'm really not Chase. Seems definitely interesting. Linear resource. I'm probably just going to want to let them sack. And then play double souls. Play souls. Flash book souls. And then attack four. Slip for space, interesting. Also, like it, he taps his red sauce here instead of the blue sauce. So, he's going to probably kill a Liliana. Leave right, leave from. Okay, it's fine. Okay, so he attacks me. Interesting as well. Oh, wait. Is this leave from? <laughs> uh, that would be crazy. Okay, just for five. You can see it's after it draws. This just seems like an engineer explosive matchup, a path to excellent matchup, a negate matchup, a Liliana matchup. Mm -hmm. I don't think I want Settles, don't think I want Stone Ace, I don't think I want Sphere, I maybe even Pur yeah, Purge is good because it can kill. Um, it should kill the. Uh, yeah, extra target Black Red Talent. Is this a counter squad matchup? Maybe it could be in the gate as well. It's not a chase matchup, it's not a troops matchup, it's not a Foxes matchup. Yeah, this one's fine. This one's really good, I think. Yeah, I didn't see the path. Yeah, this one's great. Okay, get them for one here. Okay, there's a good drum. Because it taps demons and a lava spike. Okay. Seems interesting. Okay, what do we gave? So let's see that for them. Inquisition. Okay, we take few additions, we leave them off mountain, island, and boat. So we can save it for a simulation here. Um, top top. So I'm going to be able to cast Tessica next turn. I don't need to shock myself for it. Okay, do another bolt. Not that this fits right here. I think that that's how it goes. Next time we get to play Steam version of the gate back up. I think this is one of the matchups where I quite good for carry to very shines. Okay, can't drop a pit in. Scrise, totally burn him. Okay, so let's see if it's steam missions. Um, bin forts go up, bin land. Play this tab, play the seek off the way, and attack the four. I think this is one of the matchups where seek off the way really shines. This island and passes, okay. Fine as well. 
Let's just go. Target point uses a hand and play for two. Let's go and change one. Let's cut secret coast. Okay, let's flip this base out there. And attack for seven. And let's negate back up. So we have covered non creature spells and we have covered creature spells, so we should have won pretty easily. Yep. It was a quick 2 0. So, okay. So, in the next match, I'm just going to do a toilet really quick. We'll be back to that in a second. Sorry guys, I'm back. Normally I prefer I prefer for things like that. So let's hop into round two. Playing some more Esper Seeker of the Way. I think this was a pretty good matchup for us. Okay. Okay, let me play again. Um, this one is totally fine. I believe it's a common position. Let's play Godless Shrine. No position. Okay, so more of a stompy. Hmm. Hmm. I think I want to take this. This is the most like rough to deal with. I mean, I don't care. I have to take one threat here, and I can just have this if I place it on some tool. Yeah. So here's wines. Um, aspect. Avatar and three forests. Okay, just pass it to him then, hopefully he doesn't draw on that. Okay, he just makes first go, and then we can see Russians, which is great. Yeah, this time is like, put on both of them, and then pass the turn. Here comes the avatar. You can just go and push it. Oops. Um, I didn't mean to do that, so let's just try to work it. Um, I'm just to go and pass him. And um, that's fine. So just to try and pass here. So he has to mines here. 
It's okay. I'm just gonna fetch. Fetch out blue protect tapped. I'm just gonna false score myself. We hit lingering source, nice. Okay. So I'm just gonna create a fatality here. Touching forces. Oh, I'm so going to collect for that. Okay. And get the aspect. So now let's go and fetch ahead of something. And fetch for any missiles. We probably should have taken the wines here because I don't think the SP gives like cool. Yep. Okay, so I was just going to try to force calm myself again. We need a Tessica, which is nice. Hmm. Let's see. Um, I don't want to have any forces anymore and inquisitions anymore. No more inquisitions. And no more fort scores. Yep, which looks fine. This is rich. Okay, so if it takes the interest in a dark broken quest trade. I'm gonna force the wines here. Okay, so take six here, and no, five, not nine. But now I can't take any more to my Tesco. Um, yeah, we want to place it away. Seeker of Dawei. And he just draws an hand. Yeah, no case. Oh, a chase is nice. Let's just go and draw the cards. Try to take him and see if he trades. Great chase again. Um, I don't know if that. That's what she's going to push in. Then blue. The red, white. 24 troops. Draw free. Then play the land. Play Fort Scar on him. We mailed two nice cards. And I'm just going to take the 9. Oh, I even forgot that I could have played Simulation Sparks. I think I've already won this game. Experiment 1, okay. Okay, so it's fine. Mm, I guess I can go to the
we'll just go and advance this. We have six, and now we have seven. And now we have eight damage. So Chase is doing right here as a warm up. So he is dead here. So it seems like an EE matchup. This matchup, settle matchup. Um, no, no, no. Okay, this doesn't seem like a chase matchup. I think Lady is good against him. Uh, I don't know. This is not a painful choice matchup. Oh, sorry. So we brought a world of one chase, two painful troops, and a four seas. Yeah, seems fine. But in an uh, explosive, engineer explosives, a path, and to settle. This one is really good, I think. Make time on this card. Turn to this card. Not right in the hands. This is a good against the deck. Okay, so let's do that with an uh, Inquisition. Speed of Champion rank on wines. Uh -huh. So we don't care about the Speed of Champions, but I'll take the rank review. Yeah. I'm going on to Lady of Seeker and the next one go Fartis Inquisition. Yeah. Okay, so it kicks lines here. So this is the Steel Lift Champion. Tree top, okay. Okay, this deck makes things easy. Um Visions on the top or second. They drew another first. Ouch. So I'm going to go see Pena. Oh, come on. Come on, this is like not fair. <laughs> In case of really careful visions. Try to go fetch land here. No, we are losing this game here. I mean, the only reason how I can win is if we make blocks here. That's nice. Let's just go and push here. Okay. Mm, this looks pretty devastating here. Mm, can't win this. If I don't find another hand. The Steel Leaf Champion is pretty against, pretty against the attack, but I don't think we have anything better to sideboard here. This one is good. Turn on this card, and you'll trigger and drop this card. Yep. And then Ninja in Souls. Scavenging was scavenging was aspect, Steel Leaf Champion, Steel Leaf Champion, so let's take a champion. So they have two forest, 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 
Rose as packed by champion. And the base here champion was definitely a good addition to the deck. So I think it will be the fifth this night. Which attacked um probably the the like white shark are you any of the like white shark hands? Oh my god, it's wrong. Okay, yeah, so we can pitch a delta here. We can probably pitch the second fatality. I know that's a wreck pretty good. So they have left um, aspect. Jam, Bulls, and this one. Okay, this is kind of unfortunate that I didn't draw the man here. Because now I can't go. King of the Souls. Reaching protection of you, okay. I'm taking two here. Fetching a watery grave here. Still lingering souls. And two insurance rates. Hmm, I don't know if I played this much of well. I should probably discard a land instead of a collective fatality. I think he goes very aggressive this member here. No my tokens. Flash can't be found a bit for Jimmy Blue. Hmm. As if I would run cards first. Yeah, so I'm trying to double block here to bait out the aspect. So she's gone. I think I'm not going to go him at this point. CK is nice. Not the middle anyway. Okay, we have only one land. Huh. Okay. I think I just get crazy. Seems fine. Oh, 
Oh, come on, back. This is what happens sometimes if you like that you don't find a threat. Experience one. Um, Yeah, this was nice though. I can maybe race this champion. Depending what his hand is. Okay, I can race this champion. Maybe this was a waste to use the portion of experience one. Yeah, this was not a nice go here as well. I'm just going to mine so. So he has to say, who's here? No. No, that's right, it's him. Because if he attacks Lily here, I mean, uh, he doesn't have to attack Lily, he doesn't get into trance. I mean, if like one draws to if he attacks me. Yeah. So he makes the correct play. Settle, please. Yep, GG's. I think we're on the push away. It's like a bad idea. GG's. I think I've played that match poor, uh, at least the third game. Not too bad in the second game. I've played the second game, but I've been in the land. So let's go. I really think I could have won the last game. The sequence is better. Probably can have thrown away the effective fatality. I think I'm like three misplaced it. And even with skills winning. But yeah. The first time we're not gonna play in game one. Yeah, I think I threw the game away. This one is fine. Turn one visions, turn to brutality, turn three lingering souls. Yeah. Seems fair. Again I go discard it and play the fatality. And play turn to creeping target. Depends on the matchup. I turn three creeping target and flashback souls. So right now we want to have we want to fetch with the delta because we may want to have fetch the basic right. This is different taxes. Okay, let's see. Okay, so we want to fetch here basic island. Like the absence well. Good for the scene missions. Um yeah, let's keep both. I mean it doesn't mean man in which order. What does it? No. It doesn't matter. Now we're going to have the Seeker first. If this is a push match, I just have to go for second C missions and then face more. Otherwise, I'm just going for C missions and quickly top it. This is Vampires. 
seems awkward. Okay, so let's try to the same missions. And uh, let's ping Brave and Classic to the top. But it happened. And just like my black death in Texas, probably. Yeah, so I'm just going to go down for one tree with this hand, but I could get some more stones too. This color is quite strange. Let's try it again. The soldiers. Okay, this is soldier trial. Okay. I'm just going to play classic here. This is soldier trial. We have Marshall, Marshall, and. Mm, what was it? I am played Koto. Nice it's soldiers. Which is a soldier? Okay. The swamp is one first strike. Okay. And 20 seconds has to go. So I think my basic run after that you can just go for basic paints here. And just go for a push here. And then attack in four, four. Next time we can draw us. Okay, so always if you find a second man, we can go source as well, or we can go and you make top it. It's failing. Okay. True. Sure. Why not? It means he can't play his soldier. Um, and next to me, I wish to make it easy to let you know, this time. Yeah, this doesn't matter if you take. Move this with prowess trigger. Yep. The main is still D3. Wow, oh, really? Not at all. So it's totally soon. I don't think this. I think this was the correct one because next time we can go push and fresh pick source. Yeah, got it. I'm still going to swing with seeker here. Yes, I can go. I can go double block and use the cast goal, and then I only get a kill of failure or does kitchen see that? Don't think he's going to do that. This seems like like a weak version of version of different taxes. Choose a color. Red creature as a control gun protection from the color. Okay. Do -do. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So he's going to bring a marshal here. Surprise, surprise. Then we can just go and push and fetch the souls with our fetch and We can still go for. Okay, PM, okay, I don't mind. I don't mind about this card, we're too far ahead. 
Just need me to push Fede on this withdraw fetch camp. I'm going to push Marshall. I'm going to go for two switches and blank cut here. Let's go and push here. Just gonna fresh break so it's on pass. Just like next time we have leaf of source token and picking top it. And you want to take obviously. But I have the source token. I mean I can't have with everything. Because of that second Tesla going out. Because if he like chumps, chumps, I'm winning if he goes trade Tesla, uh, like kill Tesla, kill the Seeker, he's still like 6, and I have 4 point the air and 3 and block your power. I, mean, I probably should have made this attack even if I. Didn't have Tassico, but he's just saying to kill Tassico, which is totally fine because I have a second one in hand. Yeah. And go back to 24. I think Seeker is the underrated card in model. I think it's an underrated card in Papa as well, but I don't know. I don't play that much Papa. But it really shines in this deck. Let's see what the opponent can do here. Settle the record just on our pencil, doesn't save him from fire. From flyers. This is a soldier's will, yeah. Okay, I just realized this stuff. Excuse me, I have flyers and this land, so engine explosives, fatal pushers, um Lillian after the last hill. And the wreckages. I don't want chases. At least I don't want to chase. Um, what's bad in this match? I can shake four up to this. I can shake one here and here. I don't want to shake Lilith in this matchup. Because he ha I think he has like the. Just get set up. It's pretty good against Lily. So yeah, but it seems interesting. Like I brought an engineer explosives all of three times in each matchup, so I might want to consider it my deck again. Okay, I think I'm so close here. We have no white land, but only white cards to be in position. So, this is a snap model. You know, this hand will be gas. We have like turn one in position, turn two paths and three souls, turn four souls, turn settle the wreckage. This one is good, this one is really good. I'm going to probably want to fetch a blue black here. Man, please. Yes. Yeah, we want to talk about it. Alright. We got a game. 
paints, nothing, go. Okay, so this means aftershock here. Fetch shock forties. Feels like death shadow. See that failure, rest in peace, failure, failure. Huh, interesting. We don't care about rest in peace because I don't have telegram. I care about failure and what was my last common hand that is bugged right now? I think it was par. It was either part name was push or was push. Okay, so I have to take the great here. And it was push. Okay, so he has like rip territory set up and failure. I don't care about rest in peace. Just a stake has like only Tazi Girl. Already at 13, right to pray on Death Shadows. Okay. This deck really does not care about stuff like gravitate. Just draw down to a pretty nice thing. Yeah. Let's just kind of push her. Uh, and we can even shock here because I'm going to heal me for four. I'm just going to shock. Simulations. Um, least keep that strand for MC composed. So we're settled now. Let's see that. Some fifteen. That's another territory, okay. So like before that this deck doesn't really care about Snapcast plus uh, about Rest in Peace, but in the end I think I care a little bit about it. I mean Tessica is a good card. They can play for six months as well. This is a sweet card. When decks can be up to the power for your creator, whenever decks of me, it is this karma damage to a player, exit a top card for player's library. You gain life equal to the card from the mana cast, and then every time you may cast it, cut and may spend mana to get any amount to cast it. This is cool. This is really cool, and it's a soldier, so you can probably play it like a while, and this. So let's fetch her one here. I'm probably gonna have that fountain. Not feeling I want to go ahead of something. Okay, so let's see if we draw. There it is, great. Um, I don't think I want to attack. I don't know, I probably would not block, but I don't know. Okay. 
I thought I brought you off to steal the girl hands. Although he put pumps of creatures, I think I still want to settle him. I don't want to give him the card advantage. Because my deck there is no card because it's the last one. I mean, still to mana, but I still want to settle here. Surprise, surprise. You got something that I catched. To the color. White creatures you control and protect the color. Okay. <laughs> Alright. This tile is player as no creatures. <laughs> Don't even want to fetch it because we can draw reward push and we're going to fetch basic island. If we draw a cat of five here, nice. Let's just go and help cast Kaz again. This is one. Attack for two. Let's play Tessie Green. See, I don't care about rest in peace. <laughs> so even if there's a second one of these, it's like this one was one for a strike, okay? I don't care about that. Suppression field. Activate the abilities cost two more to play and stay like that. Nice, this does nothing against what I can. <laughs> I mean, yeah, it kills fetches, but. And the other uh, trap on the sideboard, but then. Look at that, isn't it? So, yeah, well, uh, that could just finish to a sword and a dragon, so it's a sleep focus. Sadly, not. Thing about the passive girl. Let's go stack. I hit him down to two. Yep, that's a two to zero. That's so just okay. Two more games to go. Seven hundred sixty players. That's about an X match. You never see more, but. <laughs> Let's just hope someone joins you. Don't know how to join. <laughs> well, this time I guess I was going to try here. SBC code. Good luck. Great hand. This is a good hand. It's a really good hand. Square, master six and squares to top. Means of three fetches. Something from Escape Shift. Ponsel. Okay, guys, this is Ponsel. Let's so just go and. Get your basic swarm. And push this thing. At least this should be Ponsel. Yep, this looks like Ponsel. Oh, 
Watson is the new take of the problem. Yep. Um, I don't need to have done. So we have Parson, Hands, Dawn Breath. In case of this Brawl. It's fine. Where's Ponsa? Ponsa. Molten Ring. Oh no. Oh no. Okay, so. He can't cast his thing next turn, but I'm just going to do this. Not Delta. Catch up basic item. Not catch up. Let's catch up. Oh, the shrine is just the boss land. Yeah. The shrine. Or she so it's next to Andre and Stone Lane. Use it just with the Stone Lane. And the blue so as all that. Just go for the ourselves. And we mailed our Lenin source, maybe? Yeah, great. So we mailed our Lingering souls and painful troops. And play land. I didn't land about this turn. Okay. Just gonna take a fall. Next time we can just go Lily. Yeah. Mini minus the strong breath. You just pretty much getting up pretty easily. Pons is interesting. Sorry, I think we have like four basics, so it's probably okay. I have no clue about this matchup, I have never played it. My opponents can see too. Okay, so this is a path to exile matchup, this is a special to purge matchup, I think these are negate and counter score matchups. Is this a Lily matchup? I don't think so. Is this a Solid Record matchup? Maybe. It's definitely not Stony and Dampling Sphere. Not Stony. This kind of maybe Engineering Spaces matchup. I don't want Chase in here. Uh, <laughs> I don't think the Brutality is good on the floor. Um, he pushes. Um, Seeker is okay, I guess. Soldier is okay, Lily is okay. Maybe a painful truth. And I don't know how much counter magic I want here. Play it against, I'm fine against creature matchups. Mine right, seems legit. And um, so it's just gonna hit this real quick. Get to red green points now. I have no clue about the matchup. I haven't even thought about it. <laughs> no one plays Pawn, so. I would normally be causing playing Emerald Titan on my main channel, so. I would know when there are Pawn players out there. In Australia. I think this is good. I don't know, but I think it's okay. I'm just going to fetch 
put this x1 into a block push. There's another arbor of and I took this bro, okay. This can be a Titan next time. Ouch. Stonker. Um, so I guess take this and pass. Okay, so I need to cut with it. Oh, it's no place. Nice. Let's go for simulations. Um, bin, bin. Simulations. Um, bin keep. Okay, it seems like he has found something. Maybe I'm gonna try them. Oh, man. Okay. I'm totally fine with that. Hmm, let I want to keep it in there. Let's play this in class. I really like to hit um, my record. Tazigur. Got a striker. That's a nice card. Just going to get popped. Even with a clue. Nice. Nice, nice. Okay, so we want to go for the solutions. Um, I don't want secret, the source is fine. So just play two and pop this thing. And there's a little bit, just pop it inside the cube. For next turn. And probably in this draw stack. Leveling up my place. Sure. Then I'll keep draws the in my pocket. Uh -huh. I figured it out. The only problem right now is that I don't have basic planes in kinds of platinum now. Okay, that's so only fine by me. And flatten it. Ouch. Okay, so I just have to remain myself now. This helps. Yeah. Torture and plant item. Mm, I need to draw basic planes into 
multiple cards. Oh gosh. This matchup is so bad, I think. I mean, I don't think it's bad, but this card is far but I go against the deck. Or should I play any off early of this game? I mean, yeah, that's just GG. Uh, I still don't want any of these cards, I think. Yeah, fine. Oh, I want this in the play again, probably. I don't know, painful dress. Probably all I see can't be got his bolts. Mm, this is a good hand. Turn around this card. I don't even think we need to turn this card. So let's hand, I guess. Let's check out King's Fame here. Yeah. God damn it, how can someone do that? Jesus. <sighs> he can't do it. Okay. Instead of in this game, put your little keeper at the No. Oh, I am. I think we've a pretty decent chance to win here. Hang off the gods. Don't think you want to cast that. Nice not way out.
a chance. Knife check into the skull and purchase uh, BBE and block a sphinx. Scroll the spine. Speaker focus. Sense of the drop of time. Then I'm just going to pitch the main thing. Some pick for two. Being able to go and start. Oh, that was a bad play. <laughs> okay. Yeah, so let's then go. Put your physics wrong. Start to animate the carpet. And try to win more cover of things. This was actually played really bad. I also forget about that. Maybe I'm not. Let's have to discard a card as well. Yep. GG's boys. I lost the game. <laughs> uh... yeah. Let's say I throw away games. Maybe not. Maybe not. Maybe not. Maybe not. Take this one. If it takes here, I can just go and fresh pick a new sword next turn and attack for the game of life ranking damage. I'm gonna have to jump up here because there's so many red sources. I don't know. I've uh, just from uh, I've not from the game because we've lost on everything against him, but really, you've drawn six lands so far. I've drawn one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, seven eight. Discard one. Come on. Sure, get the top it. I think he has the Infernal Titan, which is like the best card in the matchup. But otherwise, I think I'm favored. If he doesn't draw up in the Titans. Actually, I have a Chomp Block here. I don't think I brought in Saddle. Go for Fort and Saddles. A path can save me. This can save me. 
Okay, so we lost one two against Palsam. And I don't think I could have won that game. Not even like topics like God. It's the last match for the day. Maybe we should have brought in several in this matchup. I mean, I guess if I um, like the thought about the pawns is like a creature on the deck, the only is by taking the creatures. At least Blood Moon and Stone Moon and stuff like that. Now this one's fine. Depends on the matchup, it's really scored up every matchup. It's control, okay, really scored. Lily is confirmed for the matchup. Inquisition. Take the gate. Nerdness. Path. Negate. Closed. Plain step. Nerdness. Huh? I think we're in gate so it's like terminals and stuff in gate. So there's the delta. You found a tool drop. See emissions. Oh my god. Top top. <laughs> and let's just go. What's going on? Pitch. And now I'm huh. interesting. Okay. Close top bottom again, I think. I don't know what he's thinking about. He should have stopped. <laughs> but I'm thinking that he plays this. Hello, opponent. Please do stuff. So I'm probably doing the pitch seeker, pitch seeker here. Because it's path and terminus. Maybe it's seek from cost. I think it's seek from cost. Maybe it's planes as well. That's probably a seeker. Mm. Hello opponent. So our opponent is doing nothing, which is pretty nice, always. <laughs> Let's just wait for him to time out and then game the match. Because I don't want to play two matches and commentate as well. I'm fetching basic swamp P and then getting the game to wait it on. Plus you can just cut easy coffee away. Seems like a good choice. I could have won that Stompy match, I think. I could have won that Pounce match as well if I set it correctly. When I found it happens, a bridge against the right. He's such a strong card. 
But this video has been pretty short, I have to say. It's like only one one hour and 45 minutes. I'd like, I think the last video with Goblin Storm took as long as this, this was only four matches, I think even longer. Hello, opponent. Um, I want to play Magic the Gallery. Still something opponent. Let's see. Stamps. Yes, I think our pawn has quit right now. He lost to pink either. Okay. So, no chance for the match. So, it's not going to be the white control.
I have hand stuff in here in my room. So I keep the hand contains two missions for score a little portion for land, which is I think a pretty good hand in the average matchup. Then I fetch for a basic island because I think he's playing blue moon just because of his unpatched seaman and he's thinking about opting or maybe he's thinking about goading me. So I decided to my scribe was like um was seeker and push and I decided to probably push to the bottom and keep the seeker on top. So I'm just going to play seeker here just since he misses lamp drop. And you can push a spell snap that if he wants to. Uh board to spell snap and push. And he can see the game. Alright. So I expect him to be in some sort of controls or spider bombs, dispels, how to scroll, perch, negate, and Liliana. Remove pass, remove pushes. And I collect the fatality. Well, yeah, when I quit again. Okay, so one more match today. Hopefully, it's the last one. Because it's already like 11 pm here. Oh, snap again. Why the heck are you going to do this to me in the last match of the last match of today? And that's just like pumps again. Don't call it. This is a hand I can keep, but I'm not happy about keeping. Uh, this hand forces me to fetch black and white, which I never want to fetch, it's a pinky. Okay, this matchup is win able, but not good. Especially not if he has like a fast start, not a bad remover, and if seekers, blah blah blah. In case no one drops off, it's fine. Okay, so we get to fetch a basic swamp green. Basic swamp and inquisition him. In case I bust me, I'm not looking for no one too. Wow. Okay. Podcast and nexus. Alright. This is a, a game I can win against the Trinity. Infinity. Okay, that's a very good chance. Image is bad for me. Door to pass, it's fine. Just grab. Hot it in here. Play a seeker. So he goes for a podcast next time. Maybe he wants to go on, on in. Okay, he's on Darkseid as well. So he can ready for a for just one now. This thing is flying too in here. Whoa. Okay. Spring wave coming. Okay, activate Nexus, attack with Nexus. Sick drum. Okay, falling already. I'm confused. <laughs> Sure. Yes.
so I can win this matchup. I can win this match. I should have path last turn. I probably should have path last turn. Okay, it's fading. Fading is here. I think that's a bit fit. It's interesting. And here are the truth basic islands, so yeah. I'm assuming I should set a nice drum. Oh, you think I'm supposed to set a nice draw as well? So yeah, so this this Ning Wings will also probably keep me alive. Maybe I have a chance against Plating. Okay, we could bring three one pop there. I can't do it seven. Don't want to block you. Alright, oh, eighteen. Mm. I'm taking seven right now, eight, nine. I think the bits. Okay, sure. A nasty feeling, all right. All right, all right. To go on the main swords. I probably think like, what the fuck is this? No, it shows I hope I don't have this kind of device. It's not as powerful as mine, so... I should say it here. Let's draw it, John. So you get my cross trees. I get to take about eight life thinking damage. And then I can start creeping my hand with these painful crews. I think if you match up, I think it's pretty good probably. I mean, 
This is like a very mini game of Thrones in between the two. But I don't know. Double Seek is gross. Lunchering Souls. I take it. I'm a 21. So we're just going to try and go and see what it does. Yep, GG. Okay, so I bring in engine explosives here, half to exile, scenario's rejection, stone silences, many of the last hope, and set of the wreckages. Um, cut down this, cut down these cards. All these forces are better spread in this matchup. Mm. I think the brutality is good because it's removal and this spells both on um, X is fine. Yeah, this one is. <laughs> ah, this one's. Oh, I think this match is pretty good off the side for him. This one is amazing, I guess, definitely. Cantrip, removal, stun silence, life gain, and minion shows. And my opponent won against a 5. Ah, poor opponent, poor opponent. Strive industry, signal test. Go. So I'm going to shrine, push, nothing. Black Seas of the Girl, pass, fetch, blue white shock hand. Stun hands. Hooray. <laughs> That was the other draw is nice. So just go simulations. Bottom path to exile, keep simulations. Okay, just because it's Yeah, so we've so we won two zero against Affinity. So we went three and two here, like three and a half and two. But I think we kind of we won the three wins were two zero and I lost were one two so you can see this deck is I think at least it's an okay deck in the new meta. But yeah we will see. So oh yeah I'm not just yeah that's right the old screen. So this is the deck expect you have you know seen the is uh lengthy if you want to great. Um I hope you enjoyed this deck tech and the video and I will keep you updated about the deck just maybe after the event. Depends on my quarter deck is actually and stuff like that. I might be sharing my list again. Like the new list and revisit and I kinda of re revisit the deck again. So yeah. Thanks for joining me and if you have any questions about the list you can like ask in a YouTube video the comments or you can ask me myself, you know, also me on you know, Facebook or Fitty Stinza or just swap me from the Xmatch group. So I would really like if you like leave a unsubscribe to our YouTube channel, it's Xmatch Players MDG, I think. And if you like give the video a thumbs up. So thanks for joining me and have a nice day. See you soon.